What is that? Found it in Ben's backpack. I just spilled water on it. Yeah. Read that. Well, this fell out? Yeah. You're the one that I've been waiting for. I'm so blessed to call you mine. Three weeks <laughs> in the grand scheme of things is nothing I get you for a lifetime. Be good. I love you, Lindsay. So I'm kind of hanging out in, in the room. It's just, just me and Marcus. And uh, Marcus stumbled upon a letter. And a letter that fell out of Ben's bag. Who is this chick? I have no idea. I'm guessing this could be his girlfriend. Guys, I'd like you to meet my friend, my confidant. I love her. I mean, he, he has a girlfriend. Yeah, he does. He absolutely has a girlfriend. And I'm what's not... funny is he's like, I have no romantic connection with anybody. Like, yeah. the second day, like, before even Michelle K went home. Dude, again, like, he could have taken, another person could have taken his place. Just like Michelle K. She had a boyfriend, yeah. apparently, that she met. The, it it kind of bothers me, you know what I mean? Because he, he's wasting everyone's time. That's his business. That's, that's his personal, you know what I mean? You... you I accidentally stumbled upon that, and that's it is what it is. So I don't, I don't know. I mean, I feel what what you think the, the move is, but I think the right thing to do is confront him. You confront him. I know, but you confront. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I uh, think it's the right move. He's gonna leave. He's gotta leave. <laughs> Money. Not, 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 not a good idea. Hey, Ben, can I talk to you? Me? <laughs> Marcus stumbled upon a letter. And this letter is from a girlfriend that Ben has back home. So we kind of both decide to confront him on it. What's up, man? So I came across something. What did you find? I just wanted to can ask me about this. How'd you come across this? Some water spill? brushing my teeth and your bag was right there. I just wanted to pull you aside to kind of get your story. Yeah. I'm not going to do it in front of anybody. I know. But I think it's like f***ed up that if it's true. I found it when I got here. Yeah. And it is true. It just seems like it's just for like from the note, the Mark Calaretta is just like, it seems like you're just here for TV. It, it just not. sounds like this. I met her three weeks ago. I just felt something very, very quickly, right before I came. She said, I love you. I don't know. Things happen fast. Look, bro, not, not to get too, too much in your business. That's, that's your business. But, like, honestly, whatever. Let's go, let's go talk up here. What the hell? It's so weird. Do you know? I have no idea. Uh, but no, I haven't, I haven't hit anything. I haven't. I've told people I have no connections here. And I've told people that... Yeah, but if you have a private If connection? you have this girl that cares about you, like, why be here, though? Claire Bear, did you hear anything? Huh? Did you hear anything as you were coming in? Do you know what's going on? I have absolutely no clue. Can you huh? go get some can you info? Just, can you be a spy? Yeah. It's perfect. Get us some info. <laughs> Maybe this is why my stomach is always uneasy. I think something else is going on. I'm a little worried. Claire's being a spy. I miss home so much. I miss what's happening so much. And this is. All right, so for me, like I'm hitting it off really well. Right. So if far. I met her like this a couple days back in Dallas, I wouldn't have come here, personally. Like if I felt so strongly, I, I wouldn't have come. Claire, what do you have to report? What's the deal? I don't really know. Um, I think um, Marcus is just confronting Ben about a letter he got. A letter? What the f Should we go up there? Yeah, let's go there. Shock with Michelle K though. It comes off as you're being disrespectful How? of other people's time. And you know that. How? How? Whose time am I trying to steal from anybody? You came on here knowingly having someone special. Yeah. Right? But yet that was not really meant. I did not do that that foul. What's up guys? What's going on? Everybody wanna come up here? Hear what's going on? We're just trying to figure this out, man. So, before I got here, I had met somebody. They found a note that she had written to me, and I had found when I got here. But she's so important to me, I would never throw this note away. Why did you even come? Because I wanted to experience this. 
And I've been totally honest with all of you. That no, I you have, haven't. I have no, not you had. you have not. I have not had connections with people here. I've been very honest. And I left my nine-year-old daughter. I left my boy too. For what? I have been sick all day, all day, missing my daughter. Because I left her to find something, a main thing, and to be in a, a group of people who want the same things as me. And that's why I'm going and home. everyone here. And that's why I'm going home. But like, why did it have to come to this for you to go home? It's not fair. I just want you to know, like, I'm offended. Like, I take this seriously. And, and I feel like this for you has been some vacation. It's like this, do you know how hard it is? You know? I know how hard it is. I'm just so disappointed. Do you not understand how hard stuff is as well? Feel like you were connected to her before or not just now did you realize that i felt like i was connected to her then you shouldn't have come ben michelle's putting herself out there and she's hurting right now it so sucks true. we all put so sorry. much on the line for this here's okay. my thing though when we stood at the rose okay. ceremony the other day you've had so many opportunities though to tell us to tell anybody i didn't think it was a huge deal having another person here that obviously is here for the wrong reasons really makes me question Who's here for what now? Is anybody here for love? It's been a, over a week. I know. He's been hanging around, taking the spot of someone who like maybe could have been here for the right reasons and that I could have ended up with. Like what, he was just gonna come and see what, like if there was some bigger, better deal going on and if there wasn't, then he was gonna go home. Like if that's what people are here for, like I'll pack my bags right now. It is such a slap in the face to me personally, to everyone else here who is doing this for the right reasons. He's wasted everyone's time here. I'm so mad at you. A letter from someone saying that she loves you, like, are you in love with her? Why the f did you come here? This is f up. And not fair. But there's some guy out there that could have been here with the right intentions. And you took his spot, and I'll never know. And that's something that I can't change and that you're going to have to live with. And just know that, like, your actions affect everyone here. You should go. There's no way to sugarcoat it. My heart's in Dallas. I wanted to see what was here. The opportunity was presented to me, and I accepted it. Yeah, I was selfish. Coming here was a mistake. Goodbye, Hollywood. I'm done with TV. Done. Like, how disappointing. This is not a free vacation for me. Do you have a girlfriend at home? I don't. Ben's gone. Whoa. What happened? Let's go. Ben apparently had a girl. That's yeah. shocking. That's not going to be great for him. He did it to himself, though. I feel bad for his girlfriend. Someone found a letter in his bag. It really was a shock. That was crazy. 